I predict a sweep by BYU women's volleyball tonight. Ooh, that's a good one. Against San Diego. Pretty good team, but it's senior night at the Smithfield House. It's really up to a group of individuals, but I think there's one person that kind of has a lot of say in that, and it's <laughs> Jen Hampson who's here with us now. Jen, a little payback for San Diego after what happened in San Diego? Uh, we're definitely excited about this game, you know? <laughs> well, that, that's such a PC answer. That is such a great answer from a seasoned veteran. We're definitely excited. <laughs> yeah, we know what you're really thinking back there. Revenge! But yeah. we can we can say that over the mic. <laughs> Jen Hampson, see, you've had senior night before in basketball, now in volleyball. What are your emotions as this is the technically the second go-around for you? <laughs> Uh, basketball is a little different because I knew it wasn't quite over my career here at BYU. And so I'm really excited for, I don't know, this game and yeah, for play for my teammates. It's your fifth year at BYU athletically. You spent four, you know, playing both sports and redshirted, you know, volleyball to play basketball and whatnot. What, what's that been like this year where it's like, okay, this actually is my last year of athletics at BYU. Uh, it's been fun. You know, it's been kind of different because I don't play basketball at all now. And so at all, like nothing, like nothing. Yeah. It's all Never going play. to volleyball. All my Church time. ball. You're not like, yeah, we're going <laughs> to win steak. <laughs> yeah. I try not to. <laughs> so yeah, it's all going to volleyball and it's been great and so fun and we're doing well this year. Did it take a while to kind of get back into the swing of things? Pun intended. <laughs> yeah, it did actually. Yeah. I lost a lot of my timing and a few things, but yeah, I've worked hard, and my teammates have helped me, and then we got back into it. This team has gone to the Sweet 16 uh, each of the last two years. You were an All-American in 2012 when uh, you went to the Sweet 16 for the first time with Sean Olmstead. You play basketball. He gets them there by beating Hawaii last year and now this year. With the, the expectation level where it is, what is the, the pinnacle goal for BYU women's volleyball this year? <laughs> I'm not sure we we don't have we have some goals though, obviously but what we want to focus on is just doing our best and getting as far as we can in the tournament and you know taking it kind of one game at a time it's really worked for us to focus just one game at a time so that's what we're going to do. We saw this with the football team there comes a point where maybe the pressure to be something else is too much uh, but is there a is there a realistic goal where you're like you know what we went to the sweet 16 without you Jen Hampson now we add you we think we can get to that at least yeah, we definitely want to get there or farther, but like I said, yeah, one game at a time is our focus. So. And, and one yeah. set at a time. One set Tonight. Of, one point at a time. <laughs> one point. One serve at a time. <laughs> <laughs> Jennifer Hampson, BYU senior volleyball star, All-American basketball and volleyball player with us on BYU Sports Nation. So you're leaving BYU, and I'm just going to go ahead and say this, probably as the most distinguished, take accomplished. Out, take out probably. No, the most distinguished, accomplished female athlete to ever wear a BYU uniform. No doubt. What does that mean to you? Um, honestly, it's just uh, it's a credit to everyone involved in my athletics. Honestly, like I can't, I couldn't have done it without support from academics, support from my coaches and administration. And honestly, it's just c contribute to this program here. I've heard the story several times of, you know, you were a gymnast growing up and whatnot. And you were, when did you quit gymnastics and, and you know, go, okay, I'm going to play basketball and volleyball? Uh, I quit gymnastics in ninth grade. So in that, that, that far in? You were, oh, wow. yeah. Wow. I wasn't good, but <laughs> I played. A, did you have a friend that did it? Like uh -huh. what? Okay. Yeah, I had a neighborhood best friend, mm -hmm. and we just did it together. So I had a hard time letting go of the friendships I had there, not necessarily a sport. So, yeah. Well, did that help you? I mean, I know that this maybe this is a stretch, but being involved in gymnastics that long, did it did it allow you to excel as, as an athlete in high school in any way? I think it helped me a lot. It helped me with like, coordination and strength and honestly learning discipline because that sport is not easy. And so, I don't know, it just helped, I think. There have been some good athletes from the high school you went to, Pleasant Grove. Uh, one we know, Zach Brady, he was a, high, he was a quarterback. Preston Hadley. Uh, there have been some guys that have gone to other schools like Stanford and whatnot. Um, mm -hmm. Brian Sampson here. Who's the greatest athlete ever from Pleasant Grove High School? Oh, I don't know. You need to say yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Who's better than you? I don't know. I'm sure there's lots of people better than me, but I don't know. I really don't know. You had the opportunity to film a commercial with us for <laughs> BYU Sports Nation. I want you to tell everyone what that experience was like. And I want you to be dead on. Was it horrible? Was it annoying? How was that commercial experience for you? It was awesome. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> oh, I love the intonation what, right what there. What was awesome about it? You know, just hang out with you guys. It's great. <sighs> okay. Yeah. Got to play some fake video games. All American yeah. All American answer right there as well. Yeah, some fake video games. Part yeah, part of that commercial is you playing so a video great. game. And it was like, you don't play video games. No. I tried. But that's okay. You acted. <laughs> you did well. You you're a dual task. All American, a dual, which is, yeah, yeah, dual exactly. sport, all American, which is fantastic. <laughs> I, I'm excited about um, the, the prospect of what happens not only w- with you in volleyball this season, but next year, just seeing what happens with you. Like, it, when will you decide? You know what? I'm going to play basketball or volleyball. Uh, I'm waiting until I'm done with volleyball here at BYU. Yeah. So end of the season. So like December or n- next year into January, February. Uh, December. December. Mm-hmm. Okay. Are there, I like? Are there offers on the table that you have to kind of? push to the side while you focus on volleyball right now for I know you got drafted and <laughs> for like volleyball in Europe or something a little bit yeah but you know just getting there. okay you seem really low-key about this <laughs> is, is that, are you not feeling any stress at all are you just like no I'm, I'm just good so I'll you got worry, a match I'll tonight you guys later. stop asking yeah. me questions about going pro <laughs> making dough because I got homework yep pretty much I'm really just putting it aside till I'm done here that's a great problem. Your parents are super supportive. I see your mom, Teresa, and, and your dad, David, at basically every home match or home game that, uh, that you've, you've been in. What does it mean to have so much family around and to have them there at every game, in basketball and volleyball? Oh, it means everything to me. You know, I love my parents, and they're so supportive, and other family that's around, and so it just means a lot to me. Senior night against San Diego. Any, any predictions for tonight? It's going to be great. Okay. I wanted you to say prediction, pain. (laughs) 18 (laughs) kills on 500 (laughs) percentage. You can watch Santa Hampson senior night. We're gathering that you will have NCAA tournament games at home because you've had such a great season. But still, this is the designated senior night if you want to watch the fabulous 6'7 Jennifer Hampson in BYU women's volleyball take on the San Diego Toreros live at 930, 730 Mountain Time. Good luck, Jen. Thank you.